Hey folks, welcome, welcome, welcome to today's stream. So what we're going to do for about the first half hour is we're going to do a video on uh, like a sort of a reaction video, okay? So what we're going to do here is uh, you open this. So we're here. Do this. And we'll get right into it. Now this is specifically on Battlefield 2042, okay? Bullets. So, um, now this is, mind you, from the beginning up until just before present day release of what the game is now. So uh, go ahead and, and just leave your comments, you know, whatever. They're, they're your opinions. I'm not going to disagree with them. So here we go. And this is by uh, from uh, Big Boss. Battlefield, Battle Failed 2042. Here we go. War. Bullets. Explosions. Chemicals. Worse. But every day, the weaponry that supplements these wars only gets better. Tens of billions of dollars. Thousands of hours of manpower. All spent on technology based on one thing. Complete and utter annihilation of the other side. <laughs> Contraption's too sick to even ponder. And over the decades, this new technology has changed warfare immeasurably. And it's only getting more advanced. Robot dogs, sentry guns, surveillance drones, and more are either already being used or are in early stages of testing. And as a result, the landscape of war is changing forever. And with 20 years of simulating modern combat with complete Super Chat action, coming in with a dollar. Thank you, Wyatt. Thank you. Thank you very much. With their next game. And in 2021, with their most up to date tech, gargantuan budget, and four whole dev teams at their disposal, they were set to launch the biggest and best Battlefield game of all time Battlefield 2042. Now, I was beta testing in this also. But first, you're there. There's a chance that over time, it could fall off. Just like it did to me. And two out of three men will experience some form of hair loss by the age of 35. But wait. Psst. Here, take this kid. Keeps offers clinically proven treatments to eliminate hair loss for good. Ah, what do you think? Do I need to get keeps? Huh? 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 Treatment plan. Look at this. Look at this beautiful silver hair. Months. Most people start seeing results within six. My God, that hairline is glorious. Is it a gimmick? Wait, how about paying half of what do you think? Prices, or a year of unlimited doctor messaging. That's right. That hair loss never stood a chance. Hair loss stops with keeps. To get 50% off your first order, go to keeps.com forward slash big boss or click the link in the description. That's K E E P S dot com forward slash big boss. November twentieth, twenty eighteen. Battlefield five has just fully. Yeah, this goes back a few years. <laughs> Critic scores are looking good, but user reviews, yeah. Not so much. This game is totally not ready for release. Big history. No atmosphere. Zero out of ten. Very slot SJW. Now, one of the biggest um, negative I aspects it. of... I did pause it. Um, one of the biggest aspects of uh, the negativity of the game was on Reddit. And I think... Uh, um, GameSpot, yeah, they they hit this game really hard, but that was early on. Also, the marketing. 
not the best. Turns out that insulting your fans and telling them not to buy your game is... Now, in the marketing aspect, that was true. The very little was ever heard of this game coming out. Uh, the I think the only time it was uh, heard was on the EA site and DICE and a leak uh, by one of their own programmers. I'm too productive here. Damn. The trailer and cosmetics of the game also proved to be controversial. And the launch came packaged with a horde of glitches, bad anti-cheat, unbalanced weapons, and massive portions of the game delayed. Overall, not great. It had also been two consecutive World War Battlefield games, and the charm was starting to wear off. Fans longed for the days of high-rise skyscrapers, map-changing events, jets, helis, and so on. Now when it comes to military shooters, DICE isn't just anyone. They're EA's golden boy. EA sees Battlefield 5's sales are, well. Now, when uh, I started uh, in beta, Battlefield Bad Company, then went into Battlefield 2, and then Battlefield 3 came out. That's when the Battlefield genre really took off. And then Battlefield 4 which was really good, but still had its issues and still does today. Then Battlefield 1, which was one of my favorite battlefields of all. Uh, then Battlefield 5, and now today, one of my favorite shooters, Battlefield 2042. Disappointing. So they decide it's time for a change. And they know just what players want. It's back to the future, kids. And this is going to be a big one. And with that, pre-production of the next Battlefield begins. Naturally, we don't hear much about Battlefield for a while. However, throughout 2021, leaks start to drip, and we get our See, first. See what I said? Rumours of a return to Modern Warfare, a soft reboot of the franchise, a game heavily inspired by Battlefield 3, 128 players on PC and next gen. Wow. Then came the horribly grainy, seizure-inducing leaked trailer footage. Quality's not great, but we're parched. <laughs> then came another, and another. They're eventually stitched into one slightly coherent trailer, and... Oh yeah. Now this looked like Battlefield. I never did play Hardline. Finally, on June the 9th, 2021, the next Battlefield is officially revealed. And it looks amazing. Also, we were now practically bathing in information. First, the bad news. The squad system is being revamped into a specialist system. Basically, this system sounds more akin to a hero shooter than a classic Battlefield game. This is controversial, but we'll have to see how it plays out. And then there's no campaign. Not a massive loss, to be honest. But that means more resources for multiplayer. Also, a ton of leaks are confirmed. 128 players, massive scale warfare, modern combat, and turns out EA is throwing four whole studios at it. They also say that it's way ahead of schedule. Also, there would be three whole. Yeah, now, no campaign when, really killed it. When when they say way ahead of schedule, they're act, EA is actually in the background forcing Dice to release this early which is probably what killed its release up until the day of what 2042 is now. Uh, it's similar to what happened with um, another game that was forced to release, and that was No Man's Sky, which is an outstanding game this day. All game sections. All Out Warfare, the traditional Battlefield experience, including Conquest and Rush, Hazard Zone, DICE's second take on a battle royale, partly inspired by Tarkov, and Portal, a game mode that includes maps, weapons, and soldiers from classic Battlefield games. Things were sounding great. And Battlefield 2042 was coming out in just four months, in October 2021. But then it's delayed by a month. But don't worry, 
everyone will have a chance to jump into the free beta in just a few weeks time. It's Friday, October 6th, and at 12 a.m. PDT, the beta goes online. I the was there. Is long on. And this is what happens. Awful player netcode results in rubber banding and abysmal hit registration. The balancing is dreadful. Bugs everywhere. And the game just generally feels off. Also, uh, where was the voice chat? A scoreboard? Anyone? What the hell is even that? This was looking real bad. Redditors take to the streets within hours. But DICE has an announcement. Gentlemen, relax. The build for the beta is a few Read months chat, old, bro. they tell us. The current build at DICE is in a lot better shape, and a ton of issues have been fixed. There's nothing to worry about. Cyberpunk, Redditors not too impressed. Really. Thank God. The game was going to be fine. For a game that's... <laughs> That was a close one. And Built the way, the way it was and then programmed for minors? Nah. Not for me. Midnight, 12th of November, 2021. We'd waited months for release and today was the day. All right, boys. It's go time. Players who'd forked out... How old am I again? Uh, there's a one and a seven in there someplace and... I haven't played. I haven't played Battlefield multiplayer yet. I've tried Call of Duty. What the fuck is this piece of shit? <laughs> this is on release day. Oh yeah, this here. This was a huge, huge problem with these hovercrafts. I mean, I, I would see endless amounts of these hovercraft in the air, and they're not supposed to do that. I would fall through the map constantly. So, yeah, it had a lot of problems on release. Now, that there, the hit registration, that was a big uh, thing and it's still happening today with hit registration in today's battlefield 2042 and if you watched any of my stuff i constantly say wow i i'm watching these bullets go right through this guy's head can't even turn left or right of course of course Players are greeted with an experience so soul-crushingly terrible. Forty twenty-two. Broken. The game really? You bombed mere hours after it launches. Only a handful of things from the beta had actually been fixed. In fact, for some people. Oh, we're, Miguel, we're going to get into that, but we're going to do this first. This is a new trend I'll be doing for YouTube. Even worse netcode. Blurrier graphics. Coming right up. Performance is awful on PC, Disgusting. and flickering and pop-ins plagues console. Oh my God! What's wrong with your face? Some fans are holding out for a comprehensive day one patch that would fix most of these issues when the game launched for everyone. But turns out that had already gone up. Here's what it fixed. But when the game actually works, you can jump into the fleshed-out and richly developed world of Battlefield 2042. The world is dark and gritty. Hey, Miss K, how you doing? It's so bad that natural disasters are almost ubiquitous, causing states to fail everywhere. Battlefield 4? Millions are starving, left without a country. It's, it's a pretty good resource war world game, causing but Germany's bankruptcy and, wait, the servers aren't really so filled anymore. Matters at all. Also, if the world is so awful, why are the soldiers like this? Brothers in Arms. I think I played one. That's a sandbox solo game, if I'm not mistaken. What the hell is that? 
Bullet spread and hit registration is still abominable, and people are unloading full mags of their weapons at point blank range and not landing a single hit. Tipsy. There are many such cases. The balancing? Well, that's still awful too. The head is one big pile of shit. The PP29 is almost the only viable automatic weapon, as it's the only one that can sort of land a shot. So naturally, half of the lobby is running around with it. Hovercrafts are also incredibly overpowered, being that they're gunned, they spawn almost indefinitely, and there's 10 of them headed directly towards your team at all times. Oh, cool. They can also climb buildings and literally fly. Then there's the squad system, essentially the core pillar of a battlefield game. This time round, it's not looking too hot. First off, it's a game with 128 players. Your squad is limited to four. Not a great start. Then, unless you're with friends, your not five as it previously was in which squad to move to prior battlefield games. A friends come online halfway through your game. Unlucky. It's time to back out to the main menu, invite them, and search for a new one. Also, there are no squad points, no chat, no spawn preview, no emotes. But you can't see what equipment your squad is carrying. 2042 today is, is a good game. Absolutely useless. Also, the addition of specialists means classes are now a thing of the past, making team play even more redundant. The specialist system also means that players on both teams look exactly the same. Didn't see that tiny friendly dot above your teammate's head? Unlucky, son. I fired one of those at uh, Demolition Ranch a couple weeks ago. Concentrated on a couple of flags, leaving about four players on any other objective. But it it goes. This is in a game of 28 people. The map size also results in running extremely long distances, only to get obliterated by snipers or helis. The actual graphics of the maps are in some cases worse than Battlefield 5. The destruction. Not great. Some buildings' walls are still destroyable. Those snipers you can't take down the actual buildings. Something you could do more than a decade ago. Yeah, that, see, that's, a lot of that's what you don't have in 2042. I still haven't seen any of this kind of destruction in 2042. You can't dope your scope in 2042 like you could in previous battlefields. Um. So for, Dope your scope means set the range to a specific distance within your scope. 100 yards, 200 yards, 300 yards, 400 yards, 500 yards. And then it jumped from 500 to 1,000. And that's when you had to take your skill to adjust within that range to get a hit. But needless to say, they fall a bit short of the mark. The content? Uh, wh where is it? This game has a total of 22 weapons. Battlefield 4 had 83. Battlefield 4 also had three times the gadgets, three more maps, and a ton more customization for aircraft and helicopters. Then there's fewer game modes at launch. But the one thing they don't say, the difference between Battlefield 4 and 2042 is, yeah, Battlefield 4 had 82 weapons, but it took you three times as long to get to that top tier weapon with its modifications. No stat page, no server browser, dog tags are gone. And so okay, no stat page, no server browser. I've never been a fan of stat pages, ever. I've never been a fan of server browser, ever. Because with server browsers, anybody can find out where you are at any given time. I don't believe in that. Just causes problems. So on. The movement. DICE said pre-launch that they were building on what they did with Battlefield 5. Let's take a look at that. Crouch sprinting. Not in the game. Rolling. Gone. Lying on your back while prone. Absent. Trick. I would probably Not say Battlefield game. 1 it's and then 2042. Like every game post 2012? Nope. You also can't dive under the water like you could in every battlefield since 4. However, if you stab the water enough times, 
you can glitch yourself under it. The UI yes, Mr. Reed, that is correct. Tell if your settings are toggled on or off. The melee, well, it speaks for itself. I'll tell your cousin I said thank you for his service. But they're lazily done. The man you're about to kill is prone. Why don't you help him up? Kick him back down again, then stab him in the chest. Now, in 2042, in, in Battlefield 4, when someone came up behind you and tried the takedown and you hit the F key, you can reverse that takedown on the other player. Well, I can't do that in 2042. That fact has changed. If he comes up behind you, you're, you're dead. Simple as that. That makes a lot of sense. DICE added AI bots to the game to pad out lobbies and make sure they're never dead. One issue, they're absolutely moronic. I'm gonna be honest with you. I, I'm kind of retarded. And lastly, there's still no stat page, voice chat, or even a scoreboard. And all of that was just the actual game design. Then uh when are you when are you appearing on the unsubscribe podcast oh god hold on Sorry about that. Uh, where were we? Let's see. Uh, da, 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 da. That's okay. Remember to mute your mic when you uh, take phone calls off. Oh, uh, unsubscribed. When are you appearing on the unsubscribe podcast? I've already appeared, but it uh, two to three weeks is when they're going to air it. So... Uh, just keep an eye out for it. It's going to be interesting, folks. Let's get on with the, uh, the viewage here. There were the bucks. Are those my footsteps on dry concrete? Oh, Why I remember this. Blanks? Did you just die with so much as a toe touching a wall or rock? Sorry, pal. Nothing I can do. You just parachute down from the sky? Well, there's a chance that it stays deployed after you land. Meaning there's now a parachute above you at all times, completely giving away your position. Vehicle physics are slightly broken. Helicopter hot landings are hot. And Every he used aimbot? Well, um... You might as well be sat directly on top of the engine. By the way, you can actually shoot yourself with that gun while getting inside. Nice. Then there's the random people frozen all around the map. No hit detection on buildings, flying across the map using a ladder, and so on. <clears throat> but hey, the main game's not great. What? And has its own is pretty forgettable. I'm new to the but chat, anyways. Wait, what's that? The ability to earn XP from it has been removed because of people boosting. That was enough 2042 for one day. Uh, I'm not Papa Veteran. I'm not Veteran Papa. I'm Grandpa Gaming. Don't confuse me with that other page. That that's, that's, has nothing to do with me. Where was the Thank you. A voice chat. A scoreboard. Legacy features. Dice response. Their scientists and engineers had been strapped for time and couldn't get them working. Hello, Hunter. But they promised these intricate and time. Welcome to TikTok. Would eventually be implemented. But forget about that. In terms of basic features, the game seemed to have regressed more than a decade. Even the graphics in some cases. Something was clearly disastrously wrong. 
and naturally the inevitable happens. Now, what they what they meant, um, I think the term is tessellation. That's where uh, your your view perspective doesn't uh, diminish at distance. So you can actually see mountains in the background, sharp, clear, and concise. But still today in uh, Battlefield 4 and 2042, in the distance, buildings will be will look like they've been destroyed or crumbled. And then as you get closer, they'll pop in as... Uh, non-destructed buildings what was a strong start with over 100k players on steam soon starts to dwindle within a single month the game falls below battlefield 5's player numbers player numbers get so bad that cheaters literally discontinue selling their own cheats because of it now Damage big bosses uh insertions of graphics is impressive what about skins? Steve, draft us up a Santa Claus outfit. That looks amazing. Jeff, whip us up a medieval knight, would you? Day of the dead man. Baz, get on it. What about a clown skin? A clown. Perfect. Perfect. These skins end up getting leaked ahead of their launch, and the backlash is so bad, Dice is forced to drop them. A series of DICE tweets also stokes some fires. First, a DICE employee tweets about fans' brutal expectations. As well, voice chat I don't think I revived the game. I think the game, game company and DICE themselves the revived the game. A pre-launch tweet where a DICE employee says that the game was in a solid state and that it wasn't his first rodeo also gains notoriety. So in a shocking twist, the developers of a released AAA game. Thank you, Phoenix. Thank you very much. Game. November 24th, patch 2 is released. This addresses the crazy... Saw you on weapons, Demo Ranch? Well addressing some other balancing issues. Pineapple... Second of December. Pineapple Pizza, were you at Demo Demolition Ranch? UI improvements and more or did you just see the video? Also, the scoreboard was supposed to release in this update, but that's been delayed. Also... Season one of the game is delayed. To okay. Summer. A full six months. Yeah, it was a very game. short As dice are so busy video. Finishing the, game. March 8th, uh, the video I'm Patch reacting to is from Big Boss. After months of work, DICE's finest engineers and top talent working around the clock, billions in R&D, and unprecedented resource allocation, DICE had cracked it. And at the UN General Assembly, they showcase an actual functioning scoreboard. My God. Nothing short of a myth. Well, Hunter, that's a decision that you're going to have to make on your own. Five months of work post launch, but now DICE's quantum mechanical scientists are on a roll. Air Force and Navy have very good. Arguably more impressive. Uh, the Army does too, somewhat, but. Voice chat. They. Navy and Air Force offer um, more training in jobs that will get you well paid in the civilian market. My favorite card game? Despite these cutting edge advancements, Almost no one is actually playing the game. Um, Over a hundred thousand have actually signed up. I would say five cards funded. stud. But on June the 9th, season one is finally released. Version 1.0. Finally, what DICE considered a full game. Seven months after launch, and season one adds one map, a specialist, two guns. Who's the guy always games. bossing you around? The Battlefield 1's first DLC oh. that included four maps. Two operations, uh, a new mode, six know, new weapons. I really can't say. We don't know who that guy is. We don't know who that guy is. He's an asshole, though. I, I will He's say an that. Asshole, yes. I agree. That guy's an asshole. Season one also includes a ton of patches, one of which fixes the bug where landing your helicopter at the pace of a falling feather. 100% what he just said, and they'll take care of you better, too. I would.
Hmm. So what went wrong? Well, let's dive in. A month after the game's launch, prominent leaker Tom Henderson releases a video explaining, from his sources, the inside scoop of development. It's interesting. According to him, due to EA's restrictions on creative freedom, a ton of DICE's veteran developers leave the studio to form their own after Battlefield 5's release. This is also when pre- Now this, this happened before. This is, this is nothing new. Uh, back in the day in, in the 90s, uh, when you played games on AOL and Genie, which some of you probably don't even know, you know, never heard of those, but there was a game out there called Air Warrior that I played a lot on Genie and then um, uh, AOL. And then EA bought out the makers of Air Warrior. It was a great game, great flight simulator, all kinds of planes, had great fun. What did EA do the minute they got their hands on it? They canned it. And then the makers left EA and developed another game, called which I do fly now, uh, Wow, it just whew, went right out of my mind. Um, production for I'll remember it just getting going here EA looks soon. Around. They see a market filled with battle royales and hero shooters, all just bursting at the seams with money. They want in, and they think Battlefield would be perfect for it. Their game plan is simple. Listen, lads, see all that popular stuff out there? Do that and DICE gets to work. In February 2019, Respawn's Apex Legends releases and basically starts printing EA money straight out the game. EA likes, so DICE takes a bit of inspiration. And in late 2019, a battle royale setting and the concept of specialists are born. Now there are a few problems surfacing. The first up being the game's engine, Frostbite. Battlefield 5 was developed in just two years meaning DICE didn't have the time to update the game's engine to the newest version. This time round, however, their game had three years in the oven, so DICE has plenty of time to upgrade. Now, it was DICE's devs who'd actually created Frostbite in the first place, so this would be a breeze. Wait, hold on. Haven't all those devs just left? Oh god. So barely anyone left at DICE knows how to actually use the engine, and naturally, 2042's Frostbite update ends up taking a while. A long while. In fact, upgrading the engine alone takes over half of the game's development time. What was supposed to take 6 months has now taken 18. Fast forward to March 2020 and everyone's working from home now. This is not good. A process that takes a few minutes in office could now take Got hours. Any also, EA has decided to backtrack and is now saying it's coming. 2042 back to a more classic battlefield formula. DICE now has to spend a ton of time redesigning the game. And now the this concept of 2042 set it back it. another six months. Has its own. August 2020. The concepts and ideas are finalized and the actual game development begins. This leaves DICE around one year and three months of actual development time. This is very short for a triple-A game of this scale. And that's compounded by the fact everyone's working from home. Also... Now, you, you heard him say a triple-A game. Now, that's how they score games upon popularity and the amount of um, game activity is going to be within the game. Now, triple-A game, okay? Remember that. New devs are still joining. In fact, at this point, almost 90% of DICE's designers had joined after Battlefield 1. 60% during 2042. DICE is now a completely different studio. I don't even know who you are. In February 2021, EA's CEO comes out to the world. The Battlefield team is doing an incredible job. The game is way ahead of internal milestones. 
Okay, way ahead of internal milestones. Now, what we have over here, Five Desert, is that merch legit? Is it Grandpa's? Um, what site did you go to? There's only one site to get my merchandise from. If that's the link that you're using, that's my merchandise. Isn't that right? Um, sure. <laughs> now, this is on release. When Dice realizes they're definitely not going to hit internal milestones. Frostbite engineers are then forced to drop their projects and jump on board. Time goes by, and progress on the game is made. And by August, the game is being baited. <laughs> yes, I play uh, Skull and Bones before the trick. Is clear. This game is hot dog shit. The only option here is clearly another delay. This game could use at least another year in the oven. No, says EA. No more delays. No more ovens. Remember what I told you about forced to early release? DICE has no choice. And on the 12th of November 2021, the game releases. And what a disaster. 2042 today is in a much more solid state, and DICE has even recently released their first reworked map. Here's how that's going. However, at this point, few people are still playing the game. 2042's Steam numbers stoop down to sub 5,000, and the game slips further into irrelevance. Claims begin to circulate that EA is now in abandoned ship mode, and that 2042 dev That is not happening today. More and more players are coming back to 2042. So, it's a good game today. Once talented developers has been squeezed dry, its talents harvested, and its franchise forever tainted. Will I be playing GTA 6? Well, most likely yes. So there you have it, folks. Um, Battlefield 2042 from conception to its final release. What do you think? Hua! Yeah. Well, uh, yeah, it's it's actually not a battle royal, but yeah, battle royal. One side's got to win, one side's got to lose. On what console, since it's not supposed to hit PC, what? Oh, GTA 6. Um... It's it's going to be on PC. I think it's going to be through Steam, though. Cyberpunk? No, I don't like Cyberpunk at all. When I have to stare at somebody's tush walking down the street in these ungodly jeans with his bare ass hanging out, nah, I draw the line right there. I, nah. <laughs> I just have a picture of that's coffee in front of me. What the fuck? So <laughs> I think GTA six won't hit PC until a year after console. Well, that, that could be true, but um, when it comes out, I, I could possibly give it a try. You will be playing it with us. Yeah. Right. And what and would you like the next battlefield to be based around? I like to have a new Vietnam game. No, I don't want to go back to Vietnam. I've been there, done that. I, uh, you know, I still have nightmares and stuff, but yeah. Um, I didn't even play battlefield Vietnam uh, or what was that? Um, call of duty. Which which one had the Vietnam in it? Battlefield, Battlefield Vietnam. Yeah, I yeah I didn't play that. Helicopters that played music 
had like yeah, uh, yeah. you know all kinds of stuff. It, it was it was good. The master was a little bit smaller. Um, a lot of issues with it, but overall it was fun just to hop in and you know get. What PC game. do I use? I used a set of custom built Zydex PCs, which if you go to the Zydex site and then go to uh, is it uh, here? I'll show you. I'll bring it up myself you can go through uh grams's website through his profile as well he has a website and you click on his sponsors go click on zydex or through his link tree yep it's all up in his youtube yeah so now if you go to players here now you're gonna have to go go down a, a ways and and uh I'll, I'll even show you. I, I met the fat electrician. I met this guy at, uh, um, demolition ranch. Uh, let's see. Keep going. I met this guy, Chris Ramsey. Um, this guy here. Met this guy. He was there. I met this guy. He was there. Met this guy and this guy, this guy. They were all there. And this guy. Him. Chuck was supposed to be there, but he never showed up. Or if he did, I didn't see him. But you go, you keep scrolling down until you see this guy here. This guy here? Okay. Yeah, you just, that's an old picture. That that picture is actually from a uh, an interview I had with South Korean uh, reporters at our old house. Now you just click on the picture. There's the GZ logo. Yeah. And these are the systems that are pre-made that you can order. Good, better, bestest. Okay? And then, of course, you can modify these specs any way you want to. And then if you use GRAMPS, all caps, you'll get a discount. And there you go. You look a lot better now than you did then. I agree. Well, back back then, uh, I was going through, through some rough health issue times. I mean, that was right after I had the double pulmonary embolism. So. DICE announced today no more seasons or new content for Battlefield 2042. Oh, well. I'm going to go verify that. Yep, will not receive any new large content updates in the future. They're probably and getting ready to release their next Battlefield, Battlefield 6. 20, 2042 will get smaller updates focusing on keeping the game running. So, yeah. Just like Battlefield 4 did. Yeah. I wonder who they're going to have uh, promoting their new game that's going to come out. Hopefully they make the right decisions. Well. If it falls under EA, they, it's they're going to be rushed. Yeah, I'm not going to get into that. So, no, I I did play Rainbow Six Siege before I had the plate put in my neck, but now it's that's almost an impossibility to run and gun. So, okay, let's get this party started. Uh, 
Um, what I want, okay, epic, yeah. Do you play any Madden? No, I, I don't play any sports games whatsoever. Even though I'm, I'm a big football, hockey fan, baseball. Hopefully next year I'll get uh, box seats for the Blues and maybe the Cardinals. <laughs> yeah, Aaron. <laughs> That's kind that'll be kind of rough. All right, I'm going to take a potty break. Be right back. Uh, just something where you practice leading targets and using bullet drop. Uh, well, the, the game would have to have the, the right ballistics, windage, um, Coriolis effect. If you're shooting long range, uh, weapon, uh, bullet. What game are you are uh, playing after that battlefield 24 two? Review. Uh, Fortnite. Why? Well, that doesn't make sense. You, you want me to play Battlefield twenty forty two? Uh, okay. I'll, I'll whatever you want to do. I'll jump in with you uh, on uh, Fortnite. Okay. Good. I I want to after the other day. I need to give twenty forty two a rest. I, it was just I was just getting aggravated as hell. So, uh, Colton, please don't advertise on my channel, please. It's very rude. Not very, extremely. Yes, they did at four o'clock this morning, my time. So you like this shirt, huh? Grandma got me this shirt. I'll be wearing this down in Miami, but this thing is, oh, it's nice. 
I think this is a Columbia. Yeah, it is Columbia. Let me know when you're ready to come in, Coffee. Do you want to know why they named it Fortnite? Not really. Gramps actually plays all, all kinds of games. Yeah. He's a, a streamer, that content creator that plays all kinds of games, man. Yeah. I'm I'm the definition of a content creator, not a streamer. I I play games from survival games to zombie games to hunting games, which uh, the Hunter Call of the Wild and Way of the Hunter are, are two of my favorite games. Play Space games, games flight simulators. Uh, Uh, wow, what? I can't, let me see. Um, El Crapo. Here we go. Let's do this. Ace is high. Flight simulator. It's now Ace is high three and it's, uh, Free to play now. It used to be fourteen ninety five a month, but now it's free to play. One of the best flight simulators, true flight simulators, not none of this War Thunder crap, but a true flight simulators with actual skins for the aircraft that were at, in actual uh, on actual World War Two planes. Well, some of my favorite games back in the day was the uh, Apache AH-64 simulator and the Abrams uh, A1 simulator.
You ever played Baldur's Gate? Uh, yeah, I did. What is this guy doing? Oh, no wonder he's a bot. That explains it. So I've got what? Four bot kills already? kills well Nemesis, we'll put that here, and we will take I just tore that guy a new... Yeah. <laughs> wow. Was that the same guy? I think it was. Drum. Whoops. You know what? I'm not going to get this guy. Wait a minute. I need to come up here.
Wow. My shots didn't go through, but hers did. Mm. I have a habit of charging in all pell-mell. Eh, well, that's not my game style. I'm very cautious. Well, thank you, USA Gaming. Thank you. It's tough to hear my game. Hold on, let me check. No, it sounds perfectly fine. Maybe in terms of volume. Yeah, my game's at... Uh... 68, which is perfect. Oops. Cancel. What's that? Now, that, now TikTok's saying my game content's not suitable, and I've already got it for 18 and up. You're good. Thank you, bus driver. I've already done that. That's Beauty. that's done. Where are dropping, homie? Um, uh, uh, let's try right there. All right. Out. I'm going on the back. I don't have a weapon. Oh, here we go. I got a weapon now. There's a guy that went to the right. One more out there somewhere. Up, oh, car coming. Yep, oh, he he left. He said, "I don't want none." Oh, he's on second floor, right hand side. Right over there. Good, coming. Yeah, I'm. Um, your bot scan.
You're welcome. Ooh. You want a shotgun? I'm good. Is this from Kim? Let's see. That's another scam. Check your latest package update. And I'll tell you what, these, these scammers, they'll do anything to take people's money. And then get away with it. So... Shield, uh, and uh, you know what? I'll take. Hmm. Shit. Is that a banana? Let's see. Could be. Ah, damn. Boy, did I miss that. Holy shit. No. We got water bender over here if you want it. Hold on, I'm doing something right now. Right there. That's one thing I hate about the game. There's um, there's a huge delay, and when you hit the E, and it actually starts getting your...
your stuff. See what I mean? You want to try this uh, bunker over here? As daddy, please don't uh, act like that. Let your mods deal with it. We got it. Okay. You want some of this gold? No, I'm good, Max. Oh, I'm good, Max. Ooh, that's a purple. Boy, if I can get... Okay, now I... Let me see. I think there is a bunker... Right... Here. Yeah, that... that big guy? That'll be the closest one right there. And there's, I think there's somebody there already. Yeah, I see you shooting. Wow. I was already healed full too. So was I. Good game. Return to lobby. That guy has a different style of play.
completely different from what I do. All right. So I read it up. Okay, cool. See that that situation we should have had some of those demolition things. Oh, absolutely. Would be great if the bot engaged too. But the bot was a little slow today. I I don't know how to control that thing. You can. Yeah, you can. You can tell it to go here, go there, but I I have I just don't know how to do it. Oh, wow. Uh, Chad, can you help him out? What's on the mount back there? And the, oh, that is the uh, Radian Raptor 61. Uh, it's my uh, newest acquirement. Actually, no, it's not my newest requirement. Uh, let's see. Um, okay. I think we can go right there. How's that? That's good. Anyone else here? I didn't see anybody. Really? Oh, you're up there? <laughs> That's funny. Here, here, here. You oh, somebody's here. down Wow got him with the first two shots <laughs> after I softened him after I softened him there you go shield up I meant to drop it, not throw it. Yeah, right. Boy. <laughs> Where's this guy's shit? Is that a DMR?
assault rifle. Need some gold? Come on down. Up. Oh, hold on. We got some people out in the field. On your left, on your left, under in in my building. Back of the head. I sure did. I got, uh, see, this is a uh, DMR, this is an assault rifle, and this is an assault rifle. I'll get rid of this one. The vault has lots of gold in it, still. So. Okay. Someone taking the things. He has a. I'll wait for you, I guess. Taking the what? Taking the tower. Oh, okay. They both have uh, charms. Medallions, you mean? Medallions. Okay. Give me the medallion. Throw me the whip. On me? Oh, it's a chicken. That was an instant. I know I got it, buddy. Did you get all the gold down there that I got? Yep, I did. I need more shields. Let's see. Oh, wait a minute here. I got... Well, we got to go the other way, buddy. We got to go back towards the southeast. You are 
taking people to church today? Uh, no, we don't do religion. I know that. It's a form of expression. Uh, I have, I've never heard that before. Yeah, taking kids to school, taking them to, going to church, taking them to church. Oh, you mean sending them back to the lobby? That shit. Okay, yeah, I'd, right. I'd, yeah. Hence your outfit. Uh, okay. Right. <clears throat> you mean the shirt I'm wearing right now? <laughs> yeah. What's wrong with my shirt? Didn't say nothing's wrong with it, brother. Looks like you're taking the, uh, these kids back to church. Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, okay. The medallions are on our left. Oop. We got, uh, let's, let's see if we can't get to the, uh, yep. Well, that one night we must've got 10 kills while we were sitting inside the bunker. Someone's there. He, he, he's right here. He's he's in the bunker. Where's, oh. There's there's one person in the bunker. Let him fight. Let him fight. Using, uh, him. Hold on. Someone's here too. Yeah. I see him. One on the left. Well, I'm getting hit from somewhere. Whoa. You're getting hit by them. When you backed off, they came up. No, they, these guys came from the outside. They came from the car. There was only one guy in the bunker. There was two. No, I only saw footsteps on one. Correct. One went left, one went right. I shot the guy on the left, you were shooting the guy on the right. When you backed off, they both came up. The chair is sick. Looks like a spaceship. <laughs> Yeah, it does sort of look like a spaceship, doesn't it? I hate this fucking song. I love it. No, that's... You don't see the footsteps, but you can hear them if he's crouched and walking. You will hear him. You just won't see where he is. Yeah, there was one outside that, that, because I got shot from behind, that's why I stepped back. The first round I took came from behind me. Yeah, the moment you stepped back, though, they, they came up. That's why they're like, oh, is it clear out? We're pushing forward.
Sorry, I don't read Cyrillic. And not the Russian. Uh, the discount code is GRAMPS30, all caps. And the chair is the PL4800 with the RGB lighting kit. We got at least two squads here. I'm down. Wow, he had a shitload of ammo. Holy smokes. He's in the bunker. And they already hired the guy. No, they didn't yet. Can't jump through the window. That's the guy that killed me right there. I think they killed it. I don't even think. Did you buy it? Did you buy it? Yeah. Oh yeah. Instantly, bro. Doon, 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 done. Bought it and left. I didn't even hear him fire. Yeah, me neither. Weird. Whatever. Just a game. Uh, the act they buff the the damage or not damage the health on the bot, but then they basically made it useless because it doesn't it doesn't do anything until you fire. It used to be able to once if the bot saw you, they were on your ass like white on rice. So yeah, the scanner is probably the best one, and then Aphrodite the healer.
I've already completed on on the hardest. I'm in five right now. As a matter of fact, Battlefield 4, I held a world record for the longest snipe. And that world record was revealed on stream when I took the shot. There's a blue uh, Thunderburst SMG down here. I'm good, dude. Thank you. I have like so many SMGs, not even funny. baby
Glenn's chat, dude. What mouse do I use? I'm using the Rocket uh, Conan Air XP. My headphones are Turtle Beach Elite Pro 2s. And you can, uh, if you use Gramps, all Co caps. Yeah, Code Gramps. What? Code Gramps. Yeah, Code Gramps, all caps. You'll get a discount on any item or items that you have in your shopping cart. I'm ready, big guy. I stand maybe 5 foot 11 and you call me a big guy. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. He's saying I'm fat, folks. That's what he's saying. <laughs> That's good, too. See? See what I mean? Just big boned. Uh-huh. Oh, no, look. Come here. I'm going to show you something, Gramps. Come here. What? See, look look right here. They misspelled Grandpa Gaming. Oh, please. Uh, there's somebody here close to me. I heard somebody. Second floor, I believe. the hell? Good job. Good try. Wow. I, I could not aim at all. My mouse did all not right. move on that guy. Another game down. Please stop spamming. Oh, that looks like a kick raid. Hey, what's up? Kickers, woohoo! Look at all them people coming in from Kick. Yeah, baby! Don't forget to subscribe on Kick now. Support me. That way, I can get verified on Kick too. Yeah, you. I'm looking to see. Uh, I got to scroll back. Ooh, that's a that's a big rate. Uh, it is. Pickle Raid. Pickle Raid. That's awesome. It's a Dill Pickle Raid. I love Dill Pickles. Thanks, folks. Thanks. Stop talking. Excuse me.
Hope you get verified. Love your clips. Well, it's going to be a while. Wow, fuzzy bear. And they, they, I, I did uh, the two-step verification, but I must, I got to have so many subscribers and gifted subscribe don't count. So it's got to be a, a uh, standard subscription. Well, Fuzzy Bear just gave you a, a sub, so there you go. Thank you, Fuzzy. Uh -huh. Fuzzy Wuzzy was a bear. Fuzzy Wuzzy had no hair. That's why they call him Fuzzy Wuzzy, the bear. Pickles looking for a girl. <laughs> Pickles what? Pickle is actually Look looking for a girlfriend. Grandpa, can you... Set him up. Sorry about that. I don't look for girlfriends anymore. Haven't for many, 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 many years. Pickle, thank you so much for, for rating Gramps. It's, it's such a cool thing to do. Thank you. Pickle talks about me. Oh, it's, yeah, damn. I hope it's all good. If it's not, that's probably why I'm not verified on kick. <laughs> Pickles having a baby soon? He gonna name it Doom. Wait a minute. How can Pickle be having a baby? If he you were use the word he. Hmm. Okay, let's hot drop. Let's let's do it. Actually, we can go right there. I'm going where you drop already. Oh my god. The old switcheroo, huh? Yeah. I'm going to the house. Country, we've been addressing that. Whoa, look at all them gifted subscriptions! Holy shit! Watch Obama TV, man. Are you seeing this? Holy, sm what 100 subs from Watch Games TV? Wow, man. After. Uh, <laughs> Woohoo! I got it. Man, I got goosebumps on that one. Look, you're taking all my cheat, man. Get my gold back. I can't show you my goosebumps because uh, all my skin's coming off. All right, let's go. What? Yeah, I, I got really burnt at San Antonio. And now I'm peeling like a... Hot potato. Let's go Whatever. get engaged down there. Oh, down here? Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Where's this guy shooting from?
He's down. He's dead. Uh, there's some sploosh right here. Oh, Roger. I'm, I'm good. All right, it's for your... I'm heading over... Ooh. I'm heading over... I would have had that guy, but my bot ran right in front of my line of fire and then you killed him. Those bots. Where are we headed, Gramps? I'm going to get me some ammo and then head over to uh, Fencing Fields. those guys back where we came from car 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 yeah I see him I need ammo. Let's uh let's get out of this fight. I don't have enough ammo. You have more one gun? Yeah, I do, but I don't have enough ammo f of the same type. I got a shotgun and two ARs. What do you need? I got ammo. I need medium ammo. Uh, yeah. Okay. Down in the railroad station. I'm down, I'm down. Heal up. I am, I am.
Oh! Right here, right here! Yeah, I know. I was already engaged on him when he came up. I should have said something. Yeah, you should have because... You were too focused on the guy I knocked. Better luck next game. Did someone hack my Facebook page? I keep seeing weird AI pics on it. <laughs> Which... What what Facebook page are you talking about? Graham only has one Facebook page, so. He's the only Grandpa Gaming. No other name, Grandpa Gaming. What did you do today, Gramps, on the beginning of your stream? What do they have to look forward to? Uh, a reaction video that I did for Battlefield 2042. So that'll be up in the next couple weeks. So, Did you go to Texas or something? Uh, or something. Yeah, I did. Uh, I went to, a, went to San Antonio for unsubscribed podcast which will air in about two to three weeks oh look at that super chat one hundred dollars coming in on a youtuber woohoo Ooh, now that gave me goosebumps dang <laughs> Uh, let me see here. Uh, great content, Gramps. Keep it coming. Well, I'm going to try. All right. Let's hot drop. I wish there was a way to drop faster. We got contact. One in the field. I don't have a gun. I still don't have a damn gun. I knocked him. His name is Mr. Burgers. <laughs> One on me. Moving in. One dead. Good job. There's still another one out somewhere. That's instant. Over on me, bro. Above me, up here. Oh, zip lining over. Somewhere. Good job, Gramps. Here, see him. Below us. I hear him, but I don't see him. Nice work. I know it's me you're talking about. <laughs>
Shut up, chat. Did you engage? Um, I will be. Outstanding. Going down below the So that's stage. where I'm going. What did you hear that? What? these chains of Hades. Yeah. Let's see here. That is, is this purple? Is this rare? Is that purple or blue? Oh, it's blue. There's a blue Tommy down here. I'm good, brother. Guys getting their people up? Now, you saw that, folks. I was standing right here shooting, and look what I hit. That's ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, look. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Another one's coming. He's above me. Chains of Hades are just violent. They're they're way too overpowered. I like it. I don't like them. Because when I use them, they don't work. What are you shooting at? Uh, uh nothing. Uh, nothing. Desk popping.
water bending. Ooh, getting shot at. Ooh, three hits and he's dead. Yeah. Full shields. Whatever. That's crazy. Don't don't get cocky, kid. Instant death. <laughs> zone uh no i've still got a couple things i need to look at here uh, okay. on me one on me on you he left he was getting ripped I hit his shields. Yeah, I hit him with the Hades and he was like, ooh, I'm out. Banamanama, Banamarama, Banamanama, Banamarama, Banamanama, Banamarama. Here we go. Secret room. Yeah, well, uh, it's coming in. Okay. Zone. Whatever. I'm moving out of the zone. All right, Bradley. Thank you for coming in. Watch your right side, bro. Medallion right. Yeah, I see him. Riddler subscribed too. All right. No, I don't stream on Twitch. Sorry. Twitch is a very bad platform for me. They're over there. Sometimes I think coffee doesn't even watch the map. I'm going to one direction and he's going an entirely different direction. Who are you talking about right next to you? And he I'm knows right. I don't I don't like to play fuck fuck games either. Uh, they're they're already up on the island. One flew up. One took the. Um... Want to take them? Uh, I suppose. Uh, yeah. You... Oh, you. Ho hold on. Ready. One, two, three, go.
not here. Oh, they're here. They're probably down in the vault room. No, they're not here. I'm going to try to open this thing. It's fine. I'll be right there with you. Oh, shit. We're not going to be able to make it. Thunderburst submachine gun. Taking it out, flying out. Yep, I'm out. Keep going north. Or west, I'm sorry, west. Head oh, over there. There's a bunker right here we can hit. Yeah, I did. And they're coming for the bunker. That's what I said. Get you out. Huh? Want me to come get you? I'm good. Oh, shit. Uh, just pick me up and go! Pick me up and go! No need to. I'm fine. Okay. I'm gonna juice you up right after this. You got heals? I got a juice. I got a juice and a, and a banana. I need to use it anyway, so I'll juice you. Eat the banana. Those uh, chains are OP. Purple Tommy there. I'm good.
hear it. What? You hear it? Yeah, I hear the Hades chains. No, 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 the vehicle, homie. Right there. No. Marcus. Scanned? And they got two bots. That's going to be rough. Yep. Well, that's why we're going to lay into them. Oh, shit. Bah, 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 bah. Damn, I fell off the waterfall. Oh, I killed a bot. Good job. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Healing, healing, healing. Oh, we gotta go, we gotta go. Oh, we're going to have to go back, so... That's fine. I see him right... Got him. Oh, I got cracked, but he's knocked. One's down below, right here. He's down below by his guy. Ouch! Nice. See? Good game. It, that shotgun had a drum. It fired twice and then reloaded on its own. That is a glitch in this damn game. Good game. Will you full up? We'll go back and look at the tape. Good game, dude. That was definitely a fun one. And my game crashed. And I reloaded all my guns before I even went into that fight. Oh, I hear you. Hey, guys, if you're ever interested in uh, getting some merchandise that Gramps uh, actually has, he has everything from hats to dogs' uh, bowls to awesome shirts to even a shirt that says, I got sniped by Gramps. Uh, Check it out. It's on his profile if you guys are interested in merch. I know some people ask for it. I have a present for you, face red. Uh, I didn't know I was being featured on Facebook. Got another subscribe from Brilder. Yeah, I know. Um, the the shotgun that that was a uh, 
mythical shotgun or not a, the, a legendary from a boss. It has five rounds. I reloaded all my shotguns and that shotgun only had, I fired twice and then it reloaded. Woo, look at all these. Received a membership gift level. Woo, who's doing that? Captain Caesar, look at all them gifted memberships. Yeah, woohoo. Yeah, baby. That's a hundred gifted memberships. Wait a minute. Is those are those just subscriptions or are they actually paid memberships? Where did coffee go? Oh, he crashed. Okay. Wow. That's amazing. Hold on, I'm gonna go get, get a refill. Hmm, more than likely, Grant's had to go to the bathroom. He'll be right back. Uh, you're probably right about that. I guess coffee abandoned me. Oh. No, my game crashed and I got stuff to do right now. Okay. Uh, a lot of new members on that. Yeah, I know. I already acknowledged them. Wow. I a hundred paid uh subscriptions. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you. More, more than that, dude. You got, you got people just sub themselves as well. So, so awesome. Yeah. Thank you for all the support. For yeah, this is a big day for me. Uh, we, um, we got some cool guy stuff in the background. So. Yeah, we do. My sign should be here in the next couple of weeks. That's going to be a, a good addition to that back wall back there. People have no idea what you're talking about. What kind of sign? 
Oh, it's a big neon sign. Well, th 38 inches, 38, 38 inch sign, neon sign says Grandpa Gaming. And then in the center, it has the GG logo, but a sniper scope. And then YouTube right above that, the YouTube emblem. So that's going to look so sweet. Right next to your uh, nice uh, YouTube uh, plaque. Yeah, my YouTube plaque. Yeah. Next plaque is a million subscribers. Yeah. And to subscribe to the channel is free, folks. So get in there, subscribe to my channel. Yeah. Yeah. You got some actually really good content coming out in the next, uh, this week and the next few weeks as well. Uh, it'll be at least weekly and a lot of shorts and clips going up. All right, Grandpa, I'll be AFK. Yeah. Uh-huh. Did my game sound just go down again? I think it did. Gifted subs are paid subscriptions for a month. And then um, the person has uh, the option of renewing it them on their own. So that had four shots. Oh, it's got a drum, that's why. See what happened? That's where I don't like automatic pickups. It made me drop my shotgun. No, that's okay, uh, Izzy. I, I'm I'm good with where I'm at right now. So it's uh, let me see something. Uh, it uh, well. So automatic pickup is a game setting? Where would that be? Uh, let's see, should be mouse and keyboard. No.
Nah, I don't, I'm not. I'm not gonna. Oh, auto pickup weapons? Yeah, I'll get it next, or sometime. Oh, good lord. <laughs> I love it. I love it. All right. So someone has the the bot. Four fours the salt. 
nemesis. Hey folks, potty break. Yes, I'm on Fortnite.
No, my freaking mouse wheel scrolled right through the weapons, right to my damn melee weapons. I was trying to switch to my shotgun, but it blew right by it and went right back to my melee weapons. Through the entire fucking line. See, the, the game makers, they do not take into account people with handicaps where they have to rely on something. If I have to look, if I have to change weapons with the keyboard, I have to look down to make sure I press the right damn key. I need more action on this game. No, I don't need more action. I need the ability to change weapons without having to look down at the damn keyboard all the time.
Somebody got the bot. Asian Jeff, never heard of him.
That shows it's closed. Two shots, that's all it took. Both to the head. Boom, boom. What am I going to play Battlefield? When I feel like it. You can't believe I came ninth? All right. Purple shotty doesn't matter. Two shots to the face instantly. Boom, boom. Yes, I do ask the photography. I got some uh, pretty good shots of the eclipse, though, although it wasn't uh, total in our area. I had my 8 inch Newtonian out and my, um, my C Star. No, I don't, I don't need, uh, I don't need a Red Bull. I've got my Dr. Pepper Zero with cherry right here. I wish they, uh, Dr. Pepper would make uh, Dr. Pepper Zero with strawberry. That would be amazing. They have strawberry and cream, but I would just like Dr. Pepper with Z Zero Dr. Pepper with strawberry. Not, I don't like the cream soda. I've never liked cream soda.
Oh, the same as I do with LMGs? Okay. That's 300 and this is 250. What do I got? Oh, that'll work. That'll work. This will work.
I wish there was a way you could still keep running straight and then look to either side without changing your direction. Yeah, I've dodged a few coffins in my time. Wow. Okay. <laughs> All right. Thank you for the super chat. Love your videos and clips. They're crazy. Yeah. Sort of crazy. I, I don't know if there's an auto run or not. You got a super chat? Yeah, $2. What did you say? It's, you didn't hear it? I just said, love your videos and clips for the second time. That's awesome. I love your videos and clips too. That's because you make them. No. I'm eating in and out. Should I bring you some in and out while uh, from California? No. He said no. Did you eat any Whataburger <clears throat> while in Texas? Uh, yeah, I did. As a matter of fact. Good. How'd you like Texas? Texas was great. We're talking about moving there next year. Yeah, it is hot there. <clears throat> Favorite burger joint? I tend to stay away from burger joints. I prefer my own hamburgers, the ones I make myself. They're great.
There's a guy over there. I saw him running right to left. Wow. All right. Eh, possible. I don't know. You can't prove it. I'm reading YouTube chat right now, Vanessa. Well, Percival, that's where you're wrong. Take a pound of lean hamburger, quarter cup of Worcestershire sauce, one cup of uh, old-fashioned oatmeal, and two eggs. You mix it all up and make your hamburger patties. Put them on the grill. You're good to go. Worcestershire, Worcestershire sauce. It's a seasoning. Uh, I'd rather have a hamburger. Tomato, lettuce, ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise, and some nice crispy dill pickles. Well, if anybody ever accuses me of cheating, they're out of their frickin' mind.
Oh, thank you for that paper crane there, RB, and the hat and the mustache. And the controller. Thank you. Thank you very much. Where the hell did that come from? Oh. That see that that's really weird. He came in sideways, looking right at me. He knew exactly where I was. Oh, you had a snipe off. Okay. Yeah, I've tried PUBG. It's a dying game. If not already dead. Come on, Bon Bon. Come on. Bonnie, let's go. Bonnie. Come on, girl. Well, see, I don't play mobile. I don't play any games on mobile other than chess.
Oh, the unsubscribe podcast was outstanding. I had a great time there. And then Demolition Ranch the next day. Woo, that was fun. Wow. Uh, well, it depends on whether you're playing Fortnite on console or not. The, the thing I don't like is the fact that they force you to uh, cross-play. They're forcing people on computer to cross-play with people with aim assist on console. Trigger my... my what? There's my trigger right there. Jeez. Trigger might? Never heard of him. Well, see, my finger, this finger and thumb have no feeling permanently. All the time. My finger hit the mouse button, switched to the uh, SMG instead of the shotgun.
Well, how to do? Well, how to do? You want to play? Friends. Uh, huh? So what? Give yes. me like five, ten minutes. Okay, yeah, different. Mm -hmm, deal damage is about 35 meters. <laughs> you playing past four hours today? Yeah. Whenever you get off, we call us here. What? So whenever you get off, let us know if you're just downloading less. Fine. All right. Of course you will. Or if you wanted to, at the end of this game, you could just stop YouTube and restart it. I know it's not what you want to hear, but that way it'll post your live and you pull that. What? What? What's? What went on? I said if you stop your YouTube stream. And then you restart it, we can pull that, but it's up to you. Oh, okay. That yeah. All right. Be right back, folks. Hold on. No, it doesn't have to be right now. I'm just saying. Oh. Between games. Well, I'm going to have to redo Insta uh, Instagram, too, so... See, that is a good example of controller against mouse. I was never in the army. Navy, yes. Well, being on a console, I expect you to be really good. No, that was a real player. That wasn't a bot.
No, I don't stream on Twitch. They say I'm too violent for Twitch, so they ban me. Oh, I saw a whatcha jiggy down there. What's a whatcha jiggy? A piñata. I saw a piñata. I have to make room for it on the desk and then program it. And I have to figure out how I want to program it.
Okay, he's to the left of the stairs. I know he didn't go up. Or did he? Wow, he went up the stairs and I didn't even see him. That's weird. I should have seen him go up the stairs.
Hey, I made top 10. Woohoo! I don't add people right now. If I started adding people, I would have to do the same thing to this account as I did with my first Steam account. Get rid of it. That's a control user. You can tell by, by the way he moves. See? I hit him five times. He hit me twice. Yeah, that's me. I I'm a kill stealer, all right. See, controller aiming is very precise with aim assist. My aiming with my handicap is all over the place. Faster reflexes. I have a .02 reflex time, even with my handicap. Why don't I use controller? Because I don't believe in it. I don't believe in aim assist, never have.
I don't know about their job of banning cheaters. Okay, I'll be right back. I have to restart the stream.